Hi. Okay. <laughs> Reading about my story. Um, I'm gonna get more in the middle. Don't want to see everyone. Um, my stories are. This is how Lucas started one of his very first days on our set, and it's a very happy set. And uh, Lucas, obviously, you guys will see, he kind of plays the hunky cowboy that gets to rescue me all the time. You know, la da da da. And. Uh, his very first time actually getting to ride this horse, and I think Lucas was trying to show off and impress everyone, maybe me a little bit. And so I've been riding horses for a long time, okay? And so he gets off on this horse, and I don't really know what happened. I guess the rope kind of broke loose or something, and the very first no, time that it happens, no. what happened? Right. It's the same thing. You come so back, like the, the ending is the same thing. Back and it pulled the rope you try to make it as like, like Cinderella. Like it's like, oh, I'm chasing her. It's like, no. You like the the rope cut his hand in the shape of a heart. Oh, yeah. So that was our right first moment, that. knowing that this would work out for the romance. Because even though he like broke his hand open, it was in the shape of a heart. So that's a cool story. Uh, and he still has the scars for it. So that was a very fun first day, I'm sure. Um, you can't see it from there. But another fun story is, do you guys all know what like continuity is, where everything has to look the same? Because we'll shoot a scene one day and the same part of that scene the next day. And I have to admit, this may not be the best thing, and I know it's so bad for you, but I love tanning. I'm sure you guys have seen pictures of me going to the tanning bed quite often because I love to tan. And uh, I am bad and unprofessional because I really, I know about continuity. I swear I did before I started this movie. And we're shooting this scene where not only Am I going to be two different shades one day? Uh, but I'm in a mini skirt and like a tank top. And uh, all of a sudden, Peter Chelson, our director, he looks at me and he's like, something's a lot different. Like, how did you change from one girl to the other? And I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about. Like, I have no idea what you're talking about. He's like, did you tan? He's like, why are you orange? And I was like, no, 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 I swear, it's bronze. It'll come right off. So we had to paint like a, almost my entire body with white powder to make me match the same way. So if you're ever doing a big film and you have to look the same, yeah, don't miss it. Film. Don't spray tan because uh, we're walking around and have like a big streak down my leg one day and not the next. So you guys will probably catch a little bit of that throughout the movie and funny things that we did. Yeah. And uh we can tell them to look for when they watch the movie so it's more so they're like stuff hey, you can look they, for. My, si my sister in the Hoedown Throwdown. Oh, Both sisters, Brandy. actually. My right. sister is the one with the really short, bright blonde hair. Right. Like, Very bright. Really blonde, like whitish blonde. And then my little sister is standing by my grandma, Margot Martindale, in this movie. So you can look for that. What else? What else can we tell them to look for? Um, gosh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. What? We've done that like yeah. four times. <laughs> oh! Oh, we're a little slow. And do you guys, well, I don't know if you guys have ever seen my little sister has just started this YouTube show. Because she must, yeah, no ends. Because she does everything I do, and now that I have the My Lady Mandy show, this is what she decided she's going to do, and she follows me around, like, stalkerati with a flip camera. I didn't even know what that was, so she's like, so, what was your favorite part of shooting the movie? What was it like working with Lucas? She's, like, giving me a full-on, like, 101 questions. So, if you look towards the end of the movie, you'll see this shot of this little girl three times, and it's actually Emily Grace, who is Noah's best friend. So, you'll see that, and, uh... This is just a kind of fun fact. You're not really going to be able to tell because you guys have never been to my house. Maybe you all have, but not that I know of. And <laughs> if you look right behind, there's a part in the movie where we build a chicken coop. And right behind, there's a barn and there's a chicken coop. And if you look past when it does, like, shots where you can see it all, the big hill behind the chicken coop is actually the hill that connects to my house. So, right, bon, that's such a southern thing. Right beyond the hills where my house sits, but that is where my house is, is right beyond that hill. So, uh, uh, I 